The causes of rheumatoid arthritis are currently unknown. However, we do know that there are likely many genes that interact with many environmental factors, ultimately culminating in the development of rheumatoid arthritis. Risk factors for rheumatoid arthritis include um, being female, which has a two to three-fold higher risk of uh, development of this disease uh, as compared to being male. There are several reproductive factors that are associated with a higher risk of RA, uh, including uh, never having had children and possibly never breastfeeding. Uh, also, we know that uh, this is a hereditary disease, and about 50 to 6 percent of the, of the total risk of developing rheumatoid arthritis is related to underlying genes. Um, there are probably 20 or 30 genes already known to be associated with a higher risk of rheumatoid arthritis, although each of them together uh, has only a small incremental risk associated uh, with it. Also, we know that the most important environmental risk factor is tobacco smoking. Patients who uh, smoke tobacco, in particular uh, individuals who also have a certain gene known as the, known as the HLA DRB1 uh, allele, are at substantially higher risk of developing rheumatoid arthritis than uh, individuals who do not smoke. Several infections are also believed to, to place individuals at a higher risk of rheumatoid arthritis. Uh, for example, certain viral infections may be able to act as nonspecific triggers of inflammation and then again, genetically susceptible individuals raise the risk of, of this disease. Um, several specific infections may also play a role. Uh, there has uh, been interest for many, many years in Epstein-Barr virus, which may be one uh, specific pathogen that can raise the risk of rheumatoid arthritis. Additionally, there is a lot of research now into the role of uh, periodontal disease, uh, and in particular, a certain bacteria known as porph Porphyromonas gingivalis, uh, which may uh, play a role in the onset of rheumatoid arthritis.